Number 7 then from the 2016 Advanced Higher Maths. A little matrix question for 6 marks. You're given this little 2x2 two two matrix with an unknown entry. And for the first part, for A, it just says, what's the determinant? Oh, well, the determinant of a 2x2 two two matrix is given by the product of the main diagonal minus the product of the other diagonal. So that'll just be negative 2. Part B. Show that a squared can be expressed in the form of pa plus qi, stating the values, that's annoying when they say that, isn't it, of p and q. What well, it says, a squared can be written as pa plus qi. We'll need to find these two things then. Do it over here. Well, a squared would be 2, 0, lambda, negative 1, 2, 0, lambda, negative 1, forming this other 2 by 2 matrix, 4 and 0 is 4, 0 and 0 is 0, 2 lambda minus lambda is 1 lambda, 0, and that's positive 1. Right, so I'll go over here. 4, 0, lambda, 1. And that should be, doing this over here, p times a, 2, 0, lambda, negative 1, plus q times i being the identity matrix with 1s in the main diagonal. Do it straight onto the spot here. So that'll be 2p plus q. For that first entry, two zeros there, p lambda and zero, so that's just p lambda, but that's negative p plus q, it's so already q minus p. If those matrices are meant to be the same, their corresponding entries must be the same, so you can form a system of equations. 2p plus q must be 4. Zero is obviously zero. p lambda must be lambda. q minus p must be 1. Well, from this line, p is 1, and if p is 1, that means that q must be 2. Just check it with this one. 2 ones are 2, and 2 is 4. So would that do for the statement? Well, I'll just write it out again. a squared equals 1 times a plus 2 times i, i.e. p equals 1 and q equals 2, even though I said it there. Now for part C, obtain a similar expression, i.e. as you got for a squared, for a to the power 4. So where did this determinant come in? Don't know. So that would be a squared times a squared. So that would be a plus 2i times a plus 2i. So that would be a squared plus 2ai plus, now strictly speaking that would be 2ia, but the identity element commutes plus 4i squared. Just tidy that up. That's a squared plus multiplying by the identity element. Of course, it leaves it unchanged, so it's plus 4a. And i squared just multiplies to i. But a squared is this. So I've got a plus 2i, as well as this part, plus 4a plus 4i. Oh, so eventually I get a to the 4 is, a to the power 4 is, 5a plus 6i. And there we go.